so he's throwing a lot of shots. And the best defense against a guy that's doing that to you is doing just exactly what he's doing. Because this is an eight round fight though, and he's letting a lot go here in round number three. And down goes Coy Evans. Sa pangalawang pagkakataon bilang undercard sa mga laban ni Manny Pacquiao sa Amerika, pinatunayan ng ating kababayan na tubong sa Buanga del Sur ang kanyang kakayahan at makapagbigay karangalan sa bansang Pilipinas. Ito ay si Ernie Sanchez, 20 anyos sa laban na ito na may kartadang 13 wins, 3 loss and 5 knockouts. Kalabani ng Pinoy ang isang American fighter na si Coy Evans sa isang 8-rounder preliminary bout. Si Coy Evans ay mas matanda ng walong taon kay Ernie Sanchez at ito ay may kartadang sampung panalo, isang talo at isang draw at meron lang dalawang knockouts. Gustong bumawi ng Amerikano sa kanyang knockout loss sa nakalipas na siyam na buwan kaya ganun na lang ito kakabado habang sa weigh-in pa lang. Bago ang lahat mga kaibigan ay huwag nyo pong kalimutang pindutin ang like at subscribe button. Nag-upload po tayo ng video isa o higit pa kada linggo. Samahan nyo po ako at balikan natin ang laban ni Ernie Sanchez versus Coy Evans. Coy Evans from Philadelphia comes in here. He's got the red and white trims with the black. Sa unang round ay kita sa Pinoy na hirap itong makakuha ng tempo. Pero tuloy-tuloy pa rin ang pagpapakawala ng punches habang pinag-aaralan ang estilo at sinusukat ang lakas ng kalaban. Streaming audience, uh, states of America, and the various networks that uh, have us. It's uh, all brought from around the arena at that time. Again, it's Sanchez with the red and blue. Coy Evans with the red and white to the right of your screen. He? he trains in the corner with him. Both guys getting jabbed out by Evans that time with the red. And on Friday, last night we had the fights at Fighter. Nice shot that time with the kid from the Philippines. Sent, went with the right hand lead and uh, immediately counted by Coy Evans. Good job by Evans. Now hard punches to the body by Ernie Sanchez. Right back comes Coy. Here comes the bell to end round number one. Standing eight count, no three knockdown roll. The fighter cannot be saved with the bell in any round. Only the referee can stop the fight. And if we get into any accidental fouls, I'll explain that uh, as it becomes pertinent to the fight. Sa pangalawang round ay naging kampante ang Pinoy. At sa glitang natulala ito nang kumonekta ang kanan ni Coy Evans. Nice short, crisp right hand. Sanchez has a tendency when he puts his jab out to bring it back to his chest instead of getting it back up high, and he can be counted with that right hand, and that's exactly what. Uh, is happening with Coy Evans doing that to him, uh, Freddie, and uh, so he knows him really well. And of course, uh, Jaime will be joining us for the new color on the telecast uh, when we. Bumawi si Ernie Sanchez sa third round at na knockdown niya ang Americano. With the right hand that's ticketed for the left side of the jaw of Ernie Sanchez. Sanchez loads up his shot, but he exposes himself, comes with the left hook, and now he's going to work with his right hand. Well, this is a nice fight all of a sudden. Sanchez tied to getting pummel with the right hand, so he's throwing a lot of shots. And the best defense against a guy that's doing that to you is doing just exactly what he's doing. Because this is an eight-round fight, though, and he's letting a lot go here in round number three. And down goes Coy Evans. How about that? It's up to four and five. He should be able to get up. His eyes are clear. It's at seven and eight. Well, he makes it back up, but that's a big surprise up the way Evans fought in the uh, last round that he's been knocked down. Sanchez will try to take him out right now because he let a lot, a lot of, an awful lot of uh, everything go. 
in this third round. Blasts him to the body. Back upstairs with the left hook. Evans' eyes appear to be clear, but his legs don't seem to be strong right now. Kid from the Philippines in the multicolored trunks comes forward, blasts that body again. Back upstairs with the left hook. Downstairs again under the elbow. Back up to the ear. Wow. Look at these. Loads up the left hand shot. And all of a sudden, this whole thing turned around. Coy can't land his right hand. And Sanchez is really all over him. And he's got uh, enough time to take him out. But I tell you, Coy comes back with a couple of chopping right hands as he gets back into this round. Sanchez has expended a lot of energy in a very early round here. Develop, and that's uh, the special heat camera. There's the knockdown, the straight right hand. And down he goes. And another normal look. Right on the chin he caught him. And back he goes. He can't hold his balance. Now here it is on the upper body where all the heat is. And it kind of looks like a uh, painting. From a Neiman. Sa mga sumunod na round ay si Ernie Sanchez na ang nagdidikta ng laban. At tuluyang hindi na nga nakabawi si Coy Evans. In this fight. Sanchez hand up and the left hand it's not the place you want to be you want to get angles when you're going to do that sort of thing either that you come into the kill zone you want to be throwing punch shot out that time he bends over he drops the left hand especially after the hook if Coy could time that right hand when he throws the left hook man red and blue from the Philippines and the fellow from Philadelphia and the USA is Coy Evans he's facing you mothered the counter that's not bad that's good Almost walked past him. Nice uppercut on the inside again by Sanchez. Sanchez having a real good round. He's not afraid to take a shot. He's in great shape. Left hook, and he's been able to gobble up that right hand that has caught him, I would say, on six or seven occasions during the course of the fight. You'll see his left eye is very puffed from getting hit by that right hand, but he's quick in it. Banks to the left, continues to circle, comes with the left hook that time. Evans just can't seem to catch up with this guy. What he needs to do is take a step off the left shoulder and stop this guy from circling to his left. He continues circling to his left, does Sanchez, and Coy can't figure him out. Best thing to do with that, now he's got him going, but he's not winning the round. All right, closing seconds now of the fight. And that final round goes in Sanchez's uh, favor, so. Ladies and gentlemen, after completing the scheduled eight rounds here at the MGM Grand Arena, we go to the scorecards to determine a winner. Judges Ciampa and Roth scored about identically at 78 to 73. And Judge Cheatham scores it 77 to 74. All three in favor of the winner, by way of unanimous decision, Ernie The Rock Sanchez.